Welcome everyone to the daily video from Wild War Keeper. Today is the Alden Daily, Fire from the Sky, where you bomb Snooch Infantryman. It's located, uh, located to the north of Alden, just above the obelisk of the moon. You first do this quest as a normal quest for Hands of Jones during That's one of the two storylines that lead you through Alden, which is a fantastic area. Anyway, on to the quest. It's a pretty simple quest to be honest. Bomb groups of ten soldiers, one at a time, to reach a hundred to pass the quest. Um, the quest is really about timing. If you want to get it done quickly, placing the mark so the soldiers walk into it is probably the easiest way. But it takes a bit of practice to I get that done right, that unless you're good at, you know. Timing, I suppose. If you do it right, you can get all ten soldiers at once, meaning that if you manage to bomb all ten at once, ten times you could pass the quest in basically a matter of minutes. There's also an achievement you can lock if you kill ten in one go. Which is usually done during the normal quest line if you know, you're lucky enough. If not, you get it fairly simple. Anyway, That's it can be a bit difficult when you have more than one other player questing alongside you as they will plant their missiles where you're about to plant yours. So there's a competition as well, which I can, can add a bit of spice if you're doing it daily and it's just tap, 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 tap until <coughs> you explode into smithereens. Or Apparently set them on fire and they jump to their own doom, which is amusing in its own sick. Being one of the two ram ram quests that gives you daily rep, I can't get that right, sorry, it's a complicated way of... So is it a ramekin? Ramekin? Anyway, and it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. And there's a simple problem with it being only one of the two daily quests that you can do for them. So, if you're looking to get rep fast, then it could be a bit of a problem since you get a maximum yet. of about what, 400, 500 I think a day. That's so well, to get to Exalted you're going to need to do a hell of a lot of days work just to get there. So it's probably best if you tabard up, go into those dungeons and grind that way. That which can also be a bit of a grind as well since you get about 10 per normal mob and well, so much per boss. They're normals however. So, to get the red gear is going to take a bit of a while to get into heroics. However, if you're doing heroics, you get more rep. So, yeah. If you just want the exalted, then you might as well do it. You can also be good gear, I suppose. Anyway, for each of these dailies, you get about 10 gold, so that can be worth as well. But since this is the fourth area you're going through in the cataclysm areas, then. Gold shouldn't have been that hard to come by by now since it's fairly given out in most quest lines. Um, not, not much else to say but goodbye. Uh, I'll get the other Eldom Daily up soon which involves smashing pygmies with a mallet which is quick, fun and still makes you chuckle and is a lot more fun than bombing a hundred soldiers at once since it's six. Anyway, till next time, goodbye.